and tag my dead Tywin Keaton. Oh, whatever you've been up to this week, it's been silly. And this one swimming naked in the fermentarium. I am the Lizard Queen! Welcome back to another Soul Singer Discovers. Today on Soul Singer Discovers, it's a patron's choice, but before we get there, Metalhead Musings. Today's Metalhead Musings comes from Pink Dragon. Pink Dragon says, In my opinion, Vocalists like Alex Terrible or Will Ramos have the best sound, but have equal talent as vocalists of other genres. Deep gutturals just sound the best to me, but saying that they have more skill is just disrespectful. Pink Dragon, I believe you and I are agreeing on the matter. We've discussed before in the comment section about whether or not some people feel that metal vocalists are more technically talented, skilled, whatever, than vocalists of other genres. I think most intelligent people agree that there's no such thing, that in every single genre there is technical capabilities that are of a high skill level and that not every other genre specific singer could do. And I think that's the same for people like Alex Terrible and Will Ramos. The gutturals they do it is just wildly outstanding. So cool. And there's a lot of other singers who cannot do that. But equally, Alex Terrible and Will probably couldn't do, for instance, some of the crazy vocals that happen in jazz. Layla Hathaway here. But say do da da do da da. All I'm saying is, everyone seems to be incredibly talented, and that's all we need to know. Thank you for that comment, Pink Dragon. I agree. Today, today is Patron's Choice, and today's Patron is Nathan. Nathan has asked for Zeeland Ardor. God bless him. I've seen Zeeland Ardor once, I think, on the channel, and then a couple of times other places, and I can safely say I really love the fusion. I know the fusion started as a joke, I believe, for Zeal and Ardor. It could be a myth, but basically they were challenged to put two genres together that shouldn't go. The combination of blues and metal? Absolutely. I'm in. We don't need to go to Rosie because I already know stuff about Zeal and Ardor and I'm very excited. Today we're going to be doing a live version. I'm going, to, I'm going to try and get this right. Please forgive me if I butcher this. I'm so sorry. Gotter Damenrung. Nope. Gotter Damerunger. Nope. Gotter Damerung. Gotterdammerung? I know that's not correct, and I'm sorry. <laughs> Where does one look up the pronunciation of these things? That's what I want to know. Nope. Google Translate was like, absolutely not, girl. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, well, never mind. Let's just do it, shall we? This is live in Budapest in 2022. It is Zeeland Ardor with Gotterdammerung. and I'm Melissa Kelly. I was so transfixed by this song that I forgot to pause. I've put a pause in here because if I don't, I'll get into a lot of trouble. Don't worry though, all of my songs that include other people's music get copyright claimed and then they are monetized, but I don't get any of the money from that monetization. They go back to the original artist. Continue. <laughs> Hey! 
Jesus. I completely forgot to pause it, damn it. Oh, YouTube's gonna make me suffer for that one. Unacceptable! Uh -huh. I forgot to pause because I was absolutely transfixed. Transfixed. That was fabulous. I, I was under no illusion that I was not gonna love this. You know what I mean? Um, I think Nathan and most of my patrons at this point are marmiting me. They're either trying to give me something I love or something I hate. I think mostly that Froggy McFrogenstein is trying to give me things I hate. But that, that was fabulous. I think he's got the two mic set up. Now I realise that one of those mics is the, the heavy distorted one, or it's the one that's got effects on it to accentuate his distorted vocals, and the other is for his more melodic. I can hear someone else singing in the background and I can't see them. Who is it? Really fabulous vocals. And to go from that sort of lilting, softer vocal, you know, the ba 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 ba, very conversational, into that crazy, like, rah, rah, rah. it's just, it felt feral. It felt feral. I like that. I like that in the background. Ah, oh, I'm so sorry that was so short. God. Damn it, Nathan. I didn't pause. I might just put a pause in, you know? <laughs> Thank you very much, Nathan. I so enjoyed this. I really did. It's the vocals. It's the distortion. It's the fact that I can hear some blues in his melodic voice. It's um, the feralness of the live performance. The whole thing. It was great. I, I want to go back and listen to it in a more clinical setting so I can pick out more detail. But that being said, for a live performance, the sound on this is not bad at all. What do you guys think? As far as the Zealand Ardor scale goes, where does this land? Would you like to hear more Zealand Ardor? I know I would. Thank you, Nathan. Thank you to my other patrons as well. <laughs> Thank you to you out there for continuing to like and subscribe and comment and fight with me. Fight with me. Until next time, my dudes, remember, when it comes to YouTube, it is better to ask for forgiveness later than permission now. Yeah.